don't miss a beat join the notification squad by clicking that bell you'll get notified every time i upload a video and be sure to join our discord to talk and get help with your code Hey everybody, we'd just like to take a moment to thank the guys over at SkySilk who made this video possible. SkySilk is a Linux-based cloud hosting platform built for developers with plans starting at just $2 a month, and they're currently giving every new sign-up a free $100 credit to try out the platform for 60 days. You can get started in just a few clicks over at SkySilk.com. Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to our fourth episode of our Discord.js tutorials. Today we'll be making a WUIS or a user, uh, user information command and let's get started. So we're going to be making it in our information folder. You don't have to specifically, you can place it wherever you want. Uh, let's create it with amazing Yes. Okay. Get our basic setup done in. Um, okay, that's our basic setup. Let's make a function which allows us to get a member more easily and used in other commands too. So we're going to create a functions.js file, and in here we're going to export export several functions just like get member which we're gonna use now we're gonna pass in a message and a to find parameter if there's no one to find it might return an error with the following code we're gonna use so we're going to default it to a empty string um, let's to lower case it first to find to lower k no to lower case um, due to performance things, we're going to do it in a good way. So we're going to see if we get an ID first. If there's no ID, get a mention. If there is a mention, otherwise we're going to find. And if none is found, we're going to default it to our message member or the message author. So we're going to find by ID first. So let's target is message members, get the ID, which is an argument we pass in. Uh, if there's no target found, but there is a mention, members, we're going to target message mentions member first. Um, if there's still no target and there is to find, we're going to target is equal to message guild members find member. Uh, we're going to return either the member display name to our case includes one if I can type properly to find otherwise we're going to remember user tag includes to find okay and if there's still no one found we're going to assign target to the author of the message the member of the message to be set like the good way because the message member is a member object the message author is a user object so we need the member so we can always transfer it to a user variable and we're going to return the target another thing we're going to do is format our date we put in function date I don't know what I did here Let's do this here we go uh, return new int date time format uh, English stage format date there we go that's our functions.js file setup 
Uh, we're going to import it right here. So, const get number and get format date. And require functions.js. We're also going to be requiring our discord.js and we're also going to get strip indents. Sometimes when you're using um, template literals in embeds, they might mess up for mobile users. So let's just don't do that. Let's find a way to prevent that with strip indents require common tags. Um, it didn't load, so we gotta install it too. Common tags. There we go. Okay, so we gotta assign our member variable. Get member, message, and our input. There we go. Uh, we're going to assign our member variables now. So member variables. We're going to split this up with user variables to keep it clear for ourselves what we're using. So const joint is format date, member joint app. And the roles a member has, member roles, filter the role, role ID. This prevents the everyone role from being added to the list. Map it by the role. Also join it. And if nothing is found or, or the list is empty, we're going to default it to none. Let's get our user variables now. Create a format date. Member user created. Okay, that's all we need actually. Let's make our embed now. Const embed is new. Which embed? Set footer. Member display name. Member user display avatar URL. Set thumbnail. Member user display. Set color. Uh, member display color. This is the same we did in another episode before. So either do this or that. X color. Um, we're going to add a field which holds our information. Member information strip indents and our cool thingy um, member display name member display name you can just enter it'll automatically make a line break for you joined at joined because we just declared a variable for that and our roles roles okay. let's also get it to true so it is in line with the other field we're gonna add add field user information strip indents again um, the user id is member user id Their username is equal to member user username Discord tag member user tag and the last the created at created needs to be role no roles 
excuse me, this needs to be rolls. And we're also going to set a timestamp on it. Uh, another fun thing we can do, if a user is playing a game or is listening to Spotify, we can detect that by using user presence game. And if, if he's playing a game or is watching something, uh, we're going to add another field. Currently playing. Strip and dance. No, we don't want that actually. Because it's... We we're not going to add several lines. Name. Um, member. User. Presence. Game. Name. And we got to set this to true too. Finally, we want to actually send it. Channel. Send. The embed. So, let's run the code. Index. You see it loaded. Let's open our Discord. There we go. As you see, I, I tried it out before. Let's see if it works again. Who is? There we go. Uh, that's without a mention with DS videos. That's with a mention. Let's try an alias. Who with an ID? That doesn't work. Oh, and I found another issue we had before, which I didn't find out. Um, aliases don't work because there was the, uh, a mistake. Before it was this array is array pool, but we need to get the aliases. Of course, otherwise we're comparing the full file and not just the aliases. So there we go. Let's try again. Index woo ID. And as you see, that works. And finally, uh, let's try with a username. Let's just do videos. And woo. Stand. Yeah, there we go. That works too. Um, thank you for watching again, and I hope to see you next time. Bye bye.